Hi everybody and welcome to Junk Modeling with Thee. I'm going to show you how to make a journal today. What you will need is a piece of cardboard, which you can then fold in half, two bits of ribbon cut in half, a piece of string, quite a long piece of string, some paper cut to fit inside your cardboard and I'd like you to have eight to ten pieces of paper, some glue, some tape, some scissors, off we go. Okay, so the first thing you'll need to do is you will need to stick your ribbons to the edges like so. Make sure that you leave enough on the outside because they're going to be used to tie a knot with um, and make sure you align them. That means that you put them in the same place so that when you close them, they align together. Okay, so that's step one. Okay, I'm going to put this to side for, the sec for a second. Step two, you're going to fold your paper very neatly. Now, I know children can do this very well because they practice at school. You line up your corner like so, and you run your finger very gently to the other corner till you press it, and then you can just run your finger along the length and voila, you've got a lovely folded piece of paper. You're going to do that with all your pieces of paper, and once you have done that, I want you to put them all one inside the other, like so, to form a little booklet. Okay, now next you will need your long string. With your long string, I want you to lay it across the middle like so. And I want you to pull it on the other side like that, tying a knot at the back because this string will hold your pieces of paper together. Now, if that seems a little bit awkward, you can get an adult to help you or another person in the family. If it's too long, the, the string, you can just cut off the excess like so. And then you have a little booklet with all your pages ready. We come back to our booklet and our cover. And now we're going to stick down our sheets of paper into our cardboard cover. Now, the way you do this is you take the, the front page and you're going to cover it with glue. Make sure that you go right up to the edges so that everything is ni nicely covered. Okay, and very careful, being very careful to get it nice and neat and straight, you're going to stick it down. Okay, you can press it down. Then you're going to repeat the same step with your other piece of paper on the back, okay? So making sure that you're covering it with glue all the way to the edges, you're going to then stretch it out, cover it down, okay? So you can rub it in and rub your other side in, taking, taking care, and then you're going to fold it in together like so. You're going to tie your ribbon. Now I didn't have a very long ribbon so if you have a longer one you could have you could tie a bow but I can only tie a knot. Okay then once you're finished you've got yourself a beautiful journal. You could decide to cover, cover it with a picture or uh, a drawing or anything of your choice. I hope you have fun. Off you go.